Okay, it's a new day and it's a... Oh, okay. <laughs> and it's a new Goodwill bins location. This guy is very loud. So we are at a new place in Portland. I have not been here before. I needed to do a Portland run to the airport and this is about five minutes from the airport. So I decided why not? Why not take advantage of that? So let's go in and see what this location is about and if it's worth going to. Let's get. I know nothing about depression glass. bins in the front here. Geox. I don't know if I've heard of that before. Those are very like Y2K looking. The spins is very like quiet. It feels very tame. But maybe that's just because I'm early. Early in that it's 1130. Here's some new water shoes. <gasps> five dollars. Well, they were five dollars. Now they're probably like a dollar. A dry rotted shoe. Oh, there it is. Antonio Milani. Never heard of that. But I will look it up. Those are very well worn sketchers. I like how they do their art. They put them in like little bins. Out of 150, Kathleen Marie.
Let's look that up. We have movies. There's just very organized. I mean, so far from what I've seen. It looks highly organized. J. Crew. Like, I would feel bad putting them in here. And my bin's just like everything's everywhere. price them individually here though. Like at mine, you would pay the glass price for these. But it's not bad, it's still around three to five it looks like per. Per um, picture, that's kind of fun. That's four dollars. Pairs, Ms. Moose. I found the match to the Rockport. I need to look up this one. Um, but they're putting new shoe bins out, and everyone's like crowding them to where you can't even look. So I will just skip what is there and check out the new bins when they come out. So let's take a look at what's out on the regular floor. Oh, this is cute if it wasn't broken. same region so I would expect it to be the same but you never know. My massive lots of clothing bins which I'm gonna do last but they're kind of like all mixed around so Oh, nope. Made in Taiwan. There was one similar to that at one of my recent bins runs. This is 
aerosols. They make purses. <laughs> and they wanted $40 at Goodwill. Oh my gosh. This would seem like leather though. I like the look, so I might get that. It's kind of heavy. We'll ultimately see if it's worth it. This is pita and something. Something smells like smoke over here too. Here's a Kate Spade. Mmm. Very dirty. It's really bad. It's pretty darn bad. Surround your needs extra large. Uh, yes. I need to smell this to make sure. No, this one doesn't smell. Okay, these are clothes. So I'm gonna come back to those. Can't get over how like calm it is in here. Weirdly calm. Because our arm is dangling. Oh my. Mm. A hanger bin. Thomas O'Brien Vintage Modern. It's like a wall hanging of a corduroy piece. I don't know what that is. Okay, let's go find some other non clothes things. It's, kinda, it's heavy, but it would be the glass price. Oh, is this, um, what is it called? Leg exerciser. <laughs> I think it promotes like blood flow. Transformers 2009. Which is kind of dirty. Clothing bins. 
Um, and then there's some lamp breakable bins at the front, and I'll try to go through those. some like smudgy stuff but I feel that could be wiped off. I'm not sure what that says but I will figure it out. Here is a coach. Looks like a vintage. Maybe a vintage coach. Like the distressing is fine, but the pen marks are hard to get out. But that is cute. Okie doke. Move it on. That is actual coach, so we get that one. Urban Diction. Cute dress. I 
I get that. It is um, Draper James Eloquy, which I don't know if it's really that great, but okay. I think I might have one more, and then I'm gonna go through some clothing. that I didn't know this snow cone. I know it does say snow cone here, but in the moment when you're going through stuff, you don't really see all the details, you know? Um, it looks like this one's missing a lot of its attachments. Okay, yeah. I'm gonna go over to the shoes. Just came out and see if. Oh, I think some of these I already saw. There's a pair of bugs. They're actually in not bad shape. There's a weird paint or something on the inside? What are you? AK Sport. Nine West, those are cute wedges. Corky, Corky's Boutique. Zodiac, that's a good brand. If I can find the other one. It's Camuto. Steve Madden's. I might get this. Tory Birch. What are these people looking for if they don't want those? <laughs> Michael Kors. Sam Edelman. I have a confusion. Then it's Camuto. Little coach hang tag. Michael Kors. 
Anne Klein. I usually don't get Anne Klein, but these are cute. They're like a chunky. Look at those. Michael Kors. What in the heck? Zara. Simply Vera. Vera Wang. Those are from Kobo's. Vera Bradley. Souls. These are kind of cute. It smells like a pickle over here. These are cute allegorias. Is the other one around? Ugh. Ugh. Hmm, I'll look up the Ugg heels and see how they do. Here's another Michael Kors. What in the heck? Michael Kors. Michael Kors, what in the world? Jessica Simpson. Michael Kors, oh my god, did someone like just give up all their Michael Kors? I might get this one if I can find the other one. Here's another pair of Uggs. These are also in good condition. Clarks. Soul Society. What are these? G.H. Bass. Cool Barra by Ugg. Those ones are pretty dirty. I'm gonna leave those. There is a lady who is very ill. And she's kind of like following me around. <laughs> okay, what else do we have? Stuart Weitzman. Where are you? These don't feel great. 
Earth Origins. Pure Golini, that's a good brand. If I can find the other one. Well, maybe I'll just be getting a whole ton of Michael Kors. What in the heck? ECBG. Those are cute if I can find the other one of those. St. John's Bay. There's a Doc Martin back there. Okay, I'm gonna go through the rest of these and I will show you what I find when I am finished. Please hold. Okay, we like got eight million pairs of shoes, so there's that. Um, I'm going to look through a few clothing, but I have to make haste because my airport people are ready. So we're gonna do a hasty little look through the clothing, and then I'm going to do a quick overview. But geez, Louise. Places like a gold mine. Where are you? Where's your top part? I don't know. We have to leave it. We don't have time. We don't have time. Maybe they get all the donations from the airport of like people's lost or like their luggage is not claimed. J. Crew size six. That is an outlet piece, which isn't bad, but. Oy. But. Not super exciting. Some 505s, the butt is ripped out. interested to know what the people who go through the bins um, initially what they're looking for because I found some like and there was like some left over there was some Doc Martens I didn't get some uh, Michael Kors I didn't get like what what are people looking for This is in Chinese. Motif by Mojang. Some kind of silk business. It'll be a silk skirt. Sure, why not? I definitely think I have my 25 pounds, so I'm not really worried about if I'm gonna make it. This looks like Betsy Johnson. What are you? Looks like it has a part that's been taken out, but I don't know. The tag would probably be on the interior part. H H workwear.
Walmart. Loft size medium. Kind of looks like a crop top. I like the color. This still has the tags on it. Oh, I've sold one of these before. They're like what policemen and women wear. Like a trench coat. It took a while to sell, so I probably won't get that one. Polo, a product of Lee Valley shirt in Ireland. Extra large. Ooh, they wore it to death. That, that's okay. What are these? Old Navy. The pillowcase. Or like good vintage Disney. This is a strangely long pillowcase. Okay, let's look over here. Cody James, extra large pearl snap. I don't know Cody James, but it looks nice, so let's get it. Okay, I think I'm gonna head up to the front because I need to go and I'm gonna look at the lamps. Um, da -dum -dum. And some of the breakables they have up there and then I will give you an overview. Forever twenty one. Some of the lamps. Oh, they want. They want thirty dollars. No, they don't. Uh, I don't think they priced this one. There are two of these. Seven each. Um, these are empty. Okay, let me go through the things I found at this very quick but very. Um, what's the word? productive bins trip. Okay, <clears throat> I've gotta go, so I'm gonna make haste. First, I found this aerosols leather bag. Um, I didn't know aerosols made bags. There's some like tarnishing scratching to these and Goodwill was selling it for 30, 40 dollars. Like, holy moly, that's insane. Okay, next we have a pair of Ms. Moos. Flat sandals. I don't know what this brand is, but we're getting it. Antonio Milani. A pair of Rockport wedges. A Cody James extra large pearl snap western shirt. A silk wrap. A motif batik halus. 
Maybe it's a top, not a skirt. But anyways, we're just getting it. Um, a vintage Mickey Mouse pillowcase. A pair, I don't know this brand either. Uh, Brantano, Brantano. Um, kind of flat. They were selling for 13 at Goodwill. Michael Kors. These were not in a Goodwill. It looks like they were a straight donation. A pair of Uggs. A little bit of wear, but overall not bad. Sometimes like this part is a little gross, but these look pretty decent. Um, another pair of Uggs. These are like heels. Another pair of Michael Kors wedge suede shoes with like a faux zip. Those are really cute actually. Uh, seven and a half. Um, I don't usually pick up Anne Klein, but I really like the look of these. They're like a chunky block heel and they're a bigger size. Uh, I'm not sure the size, but they're probably like a 10, I would say. So we're getting those. Another pair of Michael Kors wedges. Nine, size nine. I don't have anywhere else to put them. Um, a pair of Zara basic, like patenty tassel shoes. These are really fun, I like these. They are smaller, 36. A pair of, I think these are Vince Camuto leather booties. Getting those. A pair of Steve Madden. I just like the look of these. Heels, size seven and a half. Another pair of Michael Kors. I think a lady just donated all her Michael Kors shoes, to be honest. Uh, not sure the size, but I'll find it. Another pair of leather pointed Michael Kors. A pair of Coach little clog studded, like a little tiny heel. It says Coach on the back. Some rub. A pair of suede Tory Burch clog. Oh my gosh, these are adorable. Um, I did not get to look this up, but it is Francisco Biazia. So that'll be a surprise because I'm just going to get it. Um, next is a pair of Saks Fifth Avenue patent leather heels. Next is a pair of Boutique by Corky's leather sandals. Next, a pair of Sam Edelman suede block heel heels. We did the Zara, Zara's, we did that one. I like this one, it's a really pretty dress. Draper James and Eloquy, size 16. We have a coach bag. Um, another coach bag. A new soft surroundings extra large jacket. And this really pretty green. Okay, I think that's it. That was like the fastest overview I've ever done, I think. And it's a lot of shoes, but holy moly, like what in the world? I might do a quick little glance through again and see what I missed, but um, I'm in shock a little. <laughs> All right, there we go. Well, I have a feeling I'll have to come back, unless this was just like a fluke thing and this doesn't happen all the time, but I found a ridiculous, like almost my whole cart is named Brands, which is insane. So I guess I, I'll have to give this another shot. All right, if you could give this video a thumbs up, I would so appreciate it. It helps out so much. 
and it just is amazing. Amazetastic. Thank you so much. Um, all of my stuff is posted on eBay, Poshmark, and Mercari. Um, and you can email me if you'd like to purchase something directly at hellohandbakesyt at gmail.com. But until the next one, I'll see you later. Bye.